All right, we are back in the building, and we're gonna be trying a different game, Skips Graphics. We are gonna be trying Tour Minute Souls. All right, we're gonna be doing um, I don't know, just like a big part one to this. All right, this is my first time playing it. Let's go ahead and get started. Start a game. A letter for me? I never receive letters. Okay, so uh, look like we got a letter. It's from uh, John Doe, Hospital Wilberger, um, Winter Lake, Blackwood Island, Canada. Um, interact? Yeah, I just read that. Um, what's on the back? Okay. Ah! My head. What was that? A damaged photograph of two girls who appear to be twins. Do you think you can just simply abandon us here? Okay. <laughs> All right. It's been two weeks since I received that letter from the Wildberger Hospital. Since then, I haven't been fine. I can't get out of my head the image of those little girls. I can't sleep. And when I am able to fall asleep, it's only to dream horrible nightmares. I need to know what's going on. What's the meaning of all of this? I'm going to the Wildberger Hospital in hopes of finding some answers about this strange photo. I need to know what's going on. Okay, well, <laughs> um, let's go see what's going on at this mirror here. such a horrible thing to me why all right so this game is pretty much going to be a whole lot of searching around respirators in oscillalia what did they do to me why was i connected to the respirator jacket with blue jeans.
means we don't get to take it. Then. What's this? William Wood Wildberger's Diary. Let's see. Uh, today is the happiest day of my life after all the suffering we have endured the past few years. Mariah, my beloved wife, has blessed me with two beautiful angels, but there is more. After all this time, she has returned to me. She looked at me with her eyes wide as if she had not seen me in years, like she was walking, waking up from a dream. This is not all. Something odd happened when I checked my watch to find the exact time at which the first baby, Emma, was born. As I opened the lid, the glass cracked, and the hands utterly stopped. I do not think this event to have some meaning or other. I am not a superstitious man, but Maria insists that it is a sign. She has started using the hour as her lucky number and uses it for everything. Okay. Just venting. Got a birth certificate. I thought I wouldn't be able to believe anymore. All this time I have refused to let hope grow inside my chest, but now that Maria is pregnant again, I am going to believe again for Maria for those little souls. seven on it. Yeah. Um, for 
plus X is to run. Gotcha. Space is to what? What's that? We'll see. We'll see. Do not let shadows embrace you. What does that mean? I have no idea. I was thinking the same thing. Let me use this. Use. Oh, we gotta trust it. Take it. No. Examine. Adjust. Pack it up. Use. Right, I'm the man. I made it out the bathroom. <laughs> I don't know where we should go first. Should we go this way? Why is it getting off? Why did it get weird like that? Are we not supposed to go that way? <laughs> I don't know what that was about. side of a plastic heart. Okay. Huh. Left side of a plastic heart. Uh, um, let's see what else we can find in here. Now we need to find uh, the right side of it, right? <laughs> Medical books, nothing useful. A detailed mannequin of the human torso. Seven inch tape that can be used to record information. Okay. 
old files, nothing interesting. I think we're gonna need that wheel for uh, to save the game. It's not plugged in. Alright, we're gonna use that wheel right here. An old magnetophone. It looks like it works. Recording my progress might be useful if anything happens to me. You're damn right. My name is Caroline Walker. I came to Wild Burger Mansion seeking information about two girls in a photograph I received in the mail a couple of weeks ago. The last thing I remember before losing consciousness was arriving at the hospital and entering the mansion's main hall. I remember pain, and then nothing. I woke up sometime later connected to a ventilation machine. And my eye had been removed. Why? Why would someone do such a thing? I don't know what the hell is going on in this place, but I need answers. Every time I close my eyes, I see those girls. Am I going insane? that she uh, continues to read instead of having me read everything. Come on, girl, say it. It's covered in blood. <laughs> it reeks. I don't dare lift the sheet. But we don't dare to find out everything if you're going to be scurred. A vial of morphine treats minor injuries. <clears throat> Lift the damn sheet, woman. Acting like that. Lift the sheet. Did we get the other heart? We need to get the other heart. A pharmacy service window. I can't see anything on the other side. All right, I guess we're going through here then. Um, gonna go through. What happened to my thing? Remember we had a, a, a wrench, yeah. Where the hell is the wrench at? Bro, what happened to my wrench? Let's be going in here then. Let's go, do I gotta find another wrench every time? Oh shit! As I crept quietly behind my father, the clock struck 1.30. I saw him enter the mausoleum. After placing three elements on some kind of board, he went through quietly. I followed him in the distance, trying not to make a sound. For I did not want to be caught as Mother Tomb, my father sank to his knees and rested his hands on the clothes sculpted marble figure of his wife. He began running. I felt guilty following him. Seeing the cold and calculated man this way moved me. I was about to leave when Father stood up and approached the angel statue. Mother's marble tomb moved slowly to the side and exposed a narrow staircase leading into darkness. He climbed down the stairs and hesitated for a moment, my legs not wanting to take another step, but was able to stand and follow him down. Once inside, I heard metallic sounds and the echo of running water. A few moments later, I bumped into a ladder. I climbed down and found myself in a long stone tunnel covered in pipes and sewage. I saw Father's silhouette turning in a corner and, and hurriedly followed. <laughs> Before me appeared a huge metallic door and a group of men wearing strange suits like those worn to protect from radioactivity. Each carried a giant hammer. My father joined the group and they received him by hitting their hammers together. A hospital bed on each side of the group carried what appeared to be bodies covered in sheets. My father put on one of the disturbing suits and my frightened stu uh, stu stupor I loosened a brick from the wall. 
It smashed against the floor with the sound of a thousand buildings crashing down. I could feel their eyes turning to me as I fled back the way I'd come. Their guttural <laughs> voices screaming to catch me while they hit their hammers on the ground. <laughs> oh, shit. Alright, uh, is that oh, it's more shit. No, I read this right. Is that, is that correct? Eternity Ward. Looking for stuff. Oh, what's this? More nails. Uh, it's full of various medicine. guy is dead or this thing is dead uh, her fist is tightly clenched tightly clenched from rigor mortis <clears throat> okay nothing happens turn it on was left open in the middle of a procedure. The heart is missing. Something in there. It doesn't fit. Of course it doesn't. We have a whole heart. Didn't know what we needed a heart for, but this person's missing a heart, but it doesn't fit. Uh, 
there's a stable reading on the vital signs monitor. A stable reading. Who, what type of person is this still alive? Shocking her, she's just doing it. Alright, so we're gonna need um, a bigger heart or something. Mannequins are kept under these sheets.
let me. There's a certain amount of things to let you do in here. It's crazy. Stop thinking about it. Why did the old man prevent me from touching it? I should check it out. And uh, who wrote this? A maintenance crew logbook. We got everything around here, right? Sitting to a patient. Okay. Let's continue down the hall. There are symbols above the keyhole. There are symbols above the keyhole, I understand that. General, this tent after charming him, creation and work is outstanding. All right, it's locked from the yeah, of course, it is. Let's go downstairs <coughs> and let's see what's going on. See that? What the hell? Uh, let's go the opposite way.
<laughs> Who the hell is this? Oh, you know, on all of their eats. My child, you are pale. What happened to you? A person in a wheelchair with knives in his hands was chasing me. Oh, it's you. Don't you remember me? I'm the town priest. We met here in the chapel only a couple of days ago. What? I'm sorry. I don't remember you. I see. Perhaps I'm mistaken. I'm old and get confused every now and again. What is going on here, Father? Where is everybody? The patients and the hospital personnel have been transferred to the new hospital in town. This old mansion has been left pretty much abandoned. Why are all the lights off? I don't like this. I feel the same. Something evil is happening here. Something wicked that hides in the shadows. Is there a way to turn on the lights? The old generator has been playing up. It happens sometimes. Go to the end of the hall and through the door that leads to the generator room. You can restore the power from there. I see. I'll do that. Wait. Take this with you. It's not much, but it might be useful. It's dangerous to walk around the mansion unarmed. Thank you, Father, but what are you going to do without a weapon? My child, with a Bible in my hand, God protects me. Now we got a weapon. You may find what you're looking for in the library. How can I find the library? It's on the second floor of the East Wing. Take the stairs in the main hall. Oh, you'll need to unlock the door in the waiting room. Thank you. Take care, Father. Unlock the door in the waiting room. Go down in the hall. And what's this instructional sheet? Left trigger, right trigger to shoot. Uh, dodge back is left trigger X. Okay, I think I got it. So how do we get our inventory?
issue with the electronic generator, the pressure of the gas must be exact for it to ignite. The correct pressure is written on the control panel. Written on the control panel. on the control panel but it's just a map though
exactly all. Head to the library, though. Nice wing. Nice wing. I guess we're just gonna have to travel around real quick. <laughs> We'll pick up from here, man. Let me know what y'all think down in the comment section, man. If y'all want me to continue to make uh, some more gameplay videos on this, let me know. Smash that like button on the way out, and I will see everybody on the next time, yo. Peace.